back here. Prescott takes off running the football. Whoa, I don't think this is going to work out. It will. They'll be able to clock this. They were planned for it. It's down, down. Oh, my gosh. Oh, the official gets in the way. The game's oh over. Gosh. The game is over. Oh, he did. Oh, they're going to look at this. It's it's going to be over because the umpire has to touch the ball. Of course, that's ridiculous for a game to end like that, Jim. Wow, I am livid if I'm a Cowboy fan and if I'm a Niners fan. That's the fan. end of the game. The yeah. game is over. The game is over, and San Francisco survives and advances. You called it. It was risky. They had time. Dak's supposed to go, but you're not supposed to go past 10 or 12 yards. Once you get into that 13-14, the clock runs and gets away from you on something like this happens. Gene, here you go. Remember we saw this it. on the play after the fake punt? The same scenario where the umpire got in the way? He has to touch it, though. Yep. Yep. Dak doesn't yeah, realize. These guys don't realize yep. he has to touch the ball. Gene right Sterritor, you your are take. All over it. Steps into it. Pass is caught. Diggs! Sideline! Touchdown! Unbelievable! Vikings win it! see Marcus Williams here he has a shot I'm not sure really what he's thinking Joe he comes in he's got him dialed in and he just all he's got to do is make a play and even if he catches it you tackle him in bounds the game is over and I know Diggs he's he's catching this he's expecting somebody to hit him and he turns around heck nobody's there and he's off to the races and it's pandemonium Third and four, now what? Chargers take a timeout. Los Angeles takes its first timeout. This will be a 30-second timeout. Mm. What? Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, I you think the you Raiders me. were playing to get it down to either a field goal or just let the clock run out, and the Chargers took the timeout. That good, hold good, and Raiders in, Chargers out, Steelers in. Play clock at five. Pass is intercepted at the goal line by Malcolm Butler. Unreal. Malcolm Butler, who almost made... The phenomenal play that wound up in Percy's arms. There are flags on the field for a celebration. Amazing. 6 7. Here's Mitch Berger, the holder. And he, he missed, missed it. it. Can you believe that finish? John Carney had missed five of seven field goals coming into this game. And Jim Haslett told us it was because he had trouble with his holder, Mitch Berger. I don't think they ever thought it would come down to him missing an extra point. So despite the stance. Favre sprints to his right, throws back across the middle, and he's intercepted. Porter. The return by Porter, and he's brought down with seven seconds left. You're going to see Brett Favre as he rolls out. If he just runs with it, he's got open field. He's going to pick up 10, maybe 15 yards. Then they're obviously in field goal range. Instead, he tries to make a play. This is the cardinal sin for any quarterback throwing back across the grain as you're rolling to your right. You cannot see defenders that are then coming underneath in pursuit. Hartley sends the Saints to the Super Bowl. The 45-yard line. Boswell lines it up. They're going to go for it on the onside kick. The ball was deflected, and it's recovered by Jacksonville. Yeah, the ball hit Tyler Matakiewicz, 
way be way short of the yardage you needed. Ter horribly executed.